Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, it's been about 14-15 uh, hours since the uh, Part 2 Top Legendary Summon Banner for the LR Kakengoku and uh, LR Giant Ape Vegeta dropped on the global side of the game. So today, as always, we're going to be taking a look at the top grossing charts to find out whether global players can expect any kind of top grossing rewards and more importantly, top grossing Dragonstones over the next couple of days. So yeah, with that said, uh, we're going to jump in here and as you can see, we are on the Sensor Tower website. As always, we're filtered by July 26th, which is today the games category as opposed to all categories, which is what I would normally filter it by. But uh, for the anniversary, it seems like they are just going with top grossing games as opposed to overall top grossing, which is great for us because uh, it's much easier to get number one in top grossing games as opposed to all categories, right? And uh, also the iOS store. So starting with the first country, which is the US, which is where most of my viewers, you guys are from, we have Dokkan Battle at, as you can see, number three. So we're not quite there, but there is a chance that we can get there sometime you know, within the next 12 hours or so, or maybe tomorrow. So, you know, hope is uh, definitely not lost. If you guys are watching from the US, go buy some more stones, man. <laughs> I'm just playing, only if you want to. Okay, so that is the first region. Now moving on to uh, France, which as you can see, has come through. Now I looked at the top grossing for part two last year, and France was actually the only region that reached number one for all games. So yeah, once again, France coming through. Big shout out to all the French Dokkan players. And uh, that is one region we have in our pocket right now. Next up, we have Hong Kong also at number one. That's two regions. And then there is Macau, which is at number three, just like the US, very close. Possibly able to get to number one at some point, but not quite there yet. And then there is Spain, that's the fourth region at number one. Things are looking uh, really good, really, really good so far. And then we have Germany at number two, pretty good chance I would say to uh, get to number one over Hero Wars Fight the Monsters, never heard of this game, I'm guessing it's pretty good to be at number one, right? And then, uh, let's see, Italy, number two behind Candy Crush, uh, that might be kind of tough, but I believe, I believe. And then we have Belgium, which has defeated Candy Crush and is currently at number one. That's five regions. And uh, we have Austria at number two under Hero Wars once again. So yo, if you guys have played this game before, let me know what it is or how good it is because, I mean, it's doing really well, at least in terms of making money, right? So uh, yeah, Austria not there yet, but pretty close. And then we have Switzerland at number one. That is six regions and counting. Uh, we have Luxembourg at number one as well. So that is seven regions. And uh, then we have Austria at number two, uh, the Netherlands at number three. And finally, my country of Canada at number three as well. So. Uh, essentially, guys, things are looking really, really good. Really, really good. I mean, if we just count out the regions we have right now, it should be seven. Let me just quickly make sure I didn't, you know, miscount. Uh, let's see. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, wait, it's six. I didn't get seven before. Okay, either way, six is really good. <laughs> six is really good. And if you do the math, usually we get seven stones per region, right? So seven times six, that's 42 stones. Um, Yeah, I'd be pretty happy with that. I'd be really happy with that, actually, especially considering last year for part two with the uh, Golden Frieza and the 17 and then the Team Universe 7, we literally got one region. As you can see, Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle has achieved first place on top grossing games on Apple App Store in France. 
and that's it. And we got seven stones plus some Kai's and some other crap, but um, it wasn't good. It wasn't good. Oh, we got some tickets, actually. That's good. The tickets are solid. We got five rainbow tickets and 15 of the uh, regular anniversary tickets, but um, seven stones is like really, really sad. So this year, this year, it looks like we're going to be getting a lot more. Now, there's a chance that some of these regions do fall out of number one before the end of the day. So I don't want to say that like all six regions are locked in, but... I mean, I would bet that at least a couple of them will stay there, at least, I mean, I think most of them will, and then there's some other regions that are close, right, like, uh, you know, the US and Canada, um, the Netherlands, and a couple other regions at number two, so, uh, essentially, we should be looking at anywhere between, like, 30 to maybe even 50 stones, I think, on the high end, so, uh, lots of stones are coming, guys, that is kind of the point I'm trying to make. We're getting a lot of stones, uh, definitely more than last year, and uh, get ready. <laughs> get ready for that. So uh, that is your top grossing update, a lot more positive than I had expected, honestly, coming into this. Like, I wasn't really sure what to expect before I checked the rankings. I thought, like, you know, two or three might have been realistic, but my expectations were really low, considering... We only got one last year, and uh, recently we've been having some trouble hitting top grossing for some, like, pretty major banners, you know, so, yeah, I didn't know, you know, how things were gonna go, but, uh, yeah, they're looking really good if, uh, they continue the trend of last year and this year, which is to give us seven stones for every game that's reached number one in the games category, then, uh, we should be good to go. We should be good to go. At least like 30 stones, I think, is quite realistic. And then if we're lucky, if uh, things go well, things go, you know, the way they should, then we should see like 50-ish stones in our boxes uh, by the end of the week. So uh, that is your top grossing update, guys. That's all I really got to say. Thank you so much for watching. Um, best of luck on your summons, as always, on the top grossing, or sorry, uh, top legendary banner. Um, as I said before, of course, I don't think you should spend too many stones, but if you are going to summon, then hopefully you get exactly what you want. And uh, that's it, guys. Thank you so much once again. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.